In the previous episode of Two Worlds 2, Pirates of the Flying Fortress, I entered the cave to find more information about the treasure. However, I was stopped by a huge door that I was unable to open. I guess Meren can help me with this one once Teal is reunited with his body. Before going to Meren, I stopped by the ship to chat with the crew. I found a bottle by the shore. I opened it and inside I found a message about a treasure. That's interesting, but I will investigate it later. Billy put me on a quest to find a date for him and Cutter asked me to petrify another victim of the basilisk, an inventor. I went to Marin to ask for an item that means a lot for Teal's soul. She gave me a figurine that he admires a lot. That item is necessary for performing the ritual. Searching for the treasure mentioned in the bottle note, I found an entrance to an underwater cave. Inside was a dragoil a combination of a dragon and a gargoyle. He was sitting in a pile of gold. Killing the beast was easy and the treasure was mine. A few minutes later I found myself attacking savage women. I hoped that one of them would take Billy as her husband. Or at least go on a date with him. Even once. Hello beautiful people, Readers here with a continuation of the Two Worlds 2 Pirates of the Flying Fortress Let's Play series. So, I'm going to press B to get out of my map. Ah, shit, I actually forgot to disenchant a few things offline, uh, off camera. So, um, basically, I think that the problem are the rings anymore. I definitely, definitely, I mean definitely, need to get rid of them. But, um, I'm not sure if now is the perfect time. So. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I could even restart the episode now, but uh, I'm not even good at this. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not going to restart the episode, but I'm going to shiftly, like very shiftly, disenchant few items. I really hope that you don't mind so much. Um, I, I've also have not searched for uh, what best fits me <laughs> anymore. I know that I have quite some interesting gear lying around uh, some of which might be useful uh, I don't think that I'm gonna use a crossbow anytime soon no, like I mean no I still don't know about those uh, stuff okay, so that was to loot now, I am here, I'm sorry, I just spent about one minute of your, of your precious time I'm here and I'm trying to tame those ladies those very aggressive uh, not those, but uh, there are very aggressive, very aggressive women here that I'm trying to tame, to tame, in order for maybe one of them to go on a date with Billy, Billy Bug Guys, you know, the pirate that I'm trying to help find a a woman for him. So, hello, kill the aggressive dryads. Oh my gosh, look, those women. Are definitely definitely something else they actually they actually are very I mean very dangerous you cannot freaking imagine how powerful they are I mean it for real you may you may laugh with me but I died already once before from these girls definitely don't want to die again Okay. Oh, those arrows. Their arrows are like piercing my veins. So freaking dangerous creatures. So freaking dangerous. Okay. How many more? How many left? Like for real now. Oh, there are quite a few. Is that enough? Dangerous creature! Oh my. Especially the archers, I mean. Oh my gosh! I, I, I don't even know what makes them so powerful.
Oh my. Dude! Pull your weapon! You're so freaking slow, dude. Alright. That was the, the toughest thing that I've ever done, I believe. Uh, maybe uh, if you leave out the slaughter party. And I did it for bad guys. Are you kidding me? I did maybe one of the toughest quests for bad guys. And now I suppose that only friendly um, dryads are left. <sighs> no! That was a bad... That was a bad... <laughs> That was a bad guess! I guessed wrong. Oh my god. Those girls are definitely, definitely dangerous. And by far the first humans, if they are humans at all, that I face in uh, two worlds. I screwed up! Damn. Ah! <sighs> Why? Alright, maybe next time. That was by far one of the first times after so freaking long that I ran out of, um, you know, lockpicks. And I really hope that I won't need them, really. So many things to lockpick here. Oh, I hate, I hate it now. Can I go upstairs? That's interesting, can I? I mean, I mean, like, for real now. No. Not doable. Okay. With, uh, I hope, actually, let me see if I can, uh, if I have skill points to... Oh, of course I do have. I, well, I, I tend to forget about my skill points. Not so sure when they uh, really happen. That's not hard yet. So, uh, unfriendly, unfriendly house. Let's try another one. <laughs> Is this gonna be friendly? Not, now. Not yet! Not at all! Dude! How did she die? Ah! With my reflection damage! So whenever they hit me! Oh my god, this basilisk! I cannot freaking believe it! Did you know this? Did you understand what just happened? Did you understand what just happened? She died because she attacked me. How awesome is that? Let's save. Okay, now I'm going to try my best lockpick properly. Okay. Okay, back to the game. <laughs> back to business, I mean. I didn't even have time to, to look what I looted, but that's fine. Let's continue. Okay. What do you have here? Oh my god. Better gear. An oculi. Anything else? Anything for Billy? <laughs> Do you have anything for Billy in your uh, closets or whatever? Maybe underwear? He would appreciate those, I believe. Let's get outside. So, a second not so... Actually, not friendly house at all. Let's see what I... I went to this one, I believe. So, I went to the second one. Let's go to the third one, which is this one, perhaps. Uh, let's pull the bow. Aggressive again! There is a, a peaceful one. Caved. 
That's probably Billy's. Okay. Do it look like a lion? No. No. I will. Just shut up already. Woman. Oh, my bags are full. What do we have here? Potions. Okay, Sovel. That's interesting. Let's uh, lockpick a little bit. Uh, I'm not sure if I want to lockpick every single one because it's... It's time consuming. Okay. Ooh. Potions, love them. Alright, let's free her. How do I free her, actually? Why can I not free her? Don't tell me that I need the Sovo. No. Of course I don't. I have so many Sovels. Why can't I free her? Okay. Why can't I free her? I mean, what do I have to do? Let's continue with my lockpicks anyways. Maybe she needs to decide whether she wants to get out or not. Ah, lever! Okay. Nice. That makes... Whew, leveled up. Oh, you're a boy! <laughs> I thought that you were... <laughs> I thought you were a girl. Alright. Ah, he's a boy. Skip the bullshit, please. Of course. So we were walking on the beach when I noticed my friend had a new pair of red fingerless gloves. And you have to know, I love that kind of glove. So soft. I only wear the best colored calfskin. I have a yellow and green pair, and I always wanted the red <laughs> badly. So badly. Oh my gosh. So you killed your friend for his gloves. So you talked him to death. So you chopped off his... <laughs> so you chopped off his hands. Nice. No. We were kidnapped, escaped, built a raft, swam to these islands, uh, but Louise drowned on the way. Had to lug his fat ass all the way to shore. It's a boring story, really. Uh, right. Right. So, anything else you want to know about me? I love personal questions. <laughs> There's something off about you. Actually, I get that a lot. I was born to the wrong sex. Don't judge me. <laughs> you think this is easy? Being a female trapped in a man's an elf's well you know but there is a solution the cursed ring actually it's called the elven cursed ring of gender change okay the word cursed here is of liberal usage as not everyone would see that as a pox <sighs> if only those damned dryads hadn't captured me i'd still have it actually lewis has it don't jump me with excitement i have your ring yeah excellent oh i could hug you <laughs> Don't. Uh, so it was the right. the boat that I found by the shore. But I'm a hot. <laughs> now you can wear your red fingerless glove and nobody will give you a look. I wish Lewis could see it. He believed so strongly in our love. But now what? we have to forget about him somehow and start over. Billy, Actually, Billy. You know this archipelago is dangerous. You need protection. Somebody who will take care of you. Oh. You really think we both could <laughs> you know? No. No, no. I have a better candidate. He's rich. Rich? Oh, yes. <laughs> but 
is he filthy? Ah. Filthy's a good way to put it. His name's Bill. <laughs> Sounds bold. Sounds bold. On the western coast of this island, there's a charming little hut. Tell him we'll rendezvous there. All right. So uh, we lost sound. Trust me. Oh, I lost sound basically. Okay. Okay. So. Oh my God, that was a a strange, a strange, strange plot twist. So I'm going to get out. I found a lady boy. <laughs> I found a, a perfect match, a perfect match for Billy. What else can I say? I'm so freaking excited. So, um, I do have some more time. Let's see, the pirates don't cry. I just need to talk to Billy. Um, and I need to go to the science revolution. So I'm, I'm basically searching for a teleportation. That's exactly the, the case here. Okay, so completely ignoring everything and everybody, loots and stuff, uh, please, oh please, oh what a jump, uh, be careful while falling, teleportation, here I go, woohoo, what about getting this altar, of course, alright, I'm going here now, back to oh is it is it that yeah it is the closest no it is the closest i believe to the actual basilisk so i need to go and find another victim of this guy i'm so lucky that it's a grom it said that it's a grom how does groms look like is that a grom no i believe not i'm so lucky that i have a second or maybe three tiers is that a groom? Is that a groom? Uh, oh, uh, there is an X mark in the map. So perhaps this is the one. Okay. So, uh, inventory. Mm. The second one, Silas Tears. And let's move. Was the groom? Papoof! Oh, that's scary. That's fresh. <laughs> Hello. You talk. <laughs> really? Bingo. Bingo. What's your name? What's your name, Grom? Grim Grimdark. What else? The inventor. Has he been living under a rock? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Grim Grimdow. The famous. No. Basilisk, guide your tongue. What? You're not showing much gratitude. Truly. I never asked you to feed me. Well, all right. Well, all right. You did save my life, so. You're welcome. Welcome. How about a favor in return? I need a cleaning solvent. With my talent? You really daft. You know that? Wait. There is something I can do. It's funny. I've, I've helped you already. I've helped you already. It's funny. I do that to clean up, probably to clean up Billy's uh, vomit from the deck. That means that I'm doing two quests for, for Billy. One is to find a woman for him, and the other is to clean the vomit. Uh, big plans. As I say, I'm an inventor. I was searching for a certain ingredient, which I think, I hope I'm not wrong about this, could complete my life's work. Hmm. Which is? It moves mountains. Destroys whole fleets in the blink of an eye without wasting a lifetime with one's nose and magic coda. Alright, you've got my attention. You've got my attention. And I have it all planned. I had some time to do my thinking, you see. 
but I won't be able to accomplish it all by myself. Mm -hmm. Go on. Go oh, move on, man. I need to get my workshop back. Where is your workshop? Okay. Be careful though. I managed to capture one. Anyway, don't kill that one. I'll need him for the experiment. Shouldn't be a problem. Glad you say so. The right attitude is very important. <laughs> Location of your workshop. Oh, really? Where is it? Thank you. Everybody makes notes on your map on my map. Let's see if I Okay, so where do you want me to go to clear the camp? Which is the freaking camp? Uh, what did I get myself into? Are you kidding me? Where is the mark in my map, dude? Is it close here? Are you kidding me? I think that I also need to go to Tonar. Where is he? You know what to do. Okay, so I'm not clearly not done with this. Okay. What really is the case here? I mean, what is the place that I need to clean up? Which is the camp? Have I already... I may have already cleaned it up. Mayhaps. So let's check my quest. Scientific revolution. I need to find Grimm's camp, which he says is overrun by all Orums. Um, I have to be careful not to kill the one Grimm wants to keep as a specimen. Oh, please tell me that I didn't screw up uh, with this quest already, right? Because I don't see my map... Where is it? Where's the camp? I mean it. Is it in another island? No. I thought that he would mark my um, my map. Let's check out if I can find it. That is, uh, I believe it's called... Where is it? Uh, the scientific thing. Scientific revolution, it's a secondary quest. Just quickly need to find where the camp is, because if I clean it up, it's better to abandon it right now. If that is just a small glitch, it's a different story. All right, where is the camp? Camp, 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 camp. Search his tent. Um, teleport to two, uh, right away. So it is in the middle. It is here, actually. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure that I have... Ouch. Oh, actually, it's not there. It's somewhere here. It's here. I'm pretty sure that I have not... Have I? Have I cleaned everything there? Ah. Please, tell me not. Okay, I believe it's here. Hey, Olorum. Let's see, um, let's quickly check my map. Yeah, I believe that it is somewhere like here, if not here, here. What do we have here? Okay. <laughs> ah, damn it. Fall down as I hate it. Okay. Looks quite peaceful. 
Hmm. Hey. This is like a secondary quest of a secondary quest. <laughs> no, not that way really. Poisoner. So let's check again. I, I believe that I'm in the wrong path. What a rare thing for me, right? <laughs> I know. I believe that's that's the real path that I'm looking for. That's the real camp that I'm looking for. Is it saving? Yeah, I believe so. Okay, that multi-shot, I mean, it is definitely powerful. Who is freaking attacking me? And how dare he? Yeah, I agree. Talk to Grim. Are we done with the killing? The coast is clear. Okay. Subject still alive. Perfunctory. <laughs> Good. She may work immediately. But first, I'll need one no! 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 What? A digested grass. I'll go on. I'm the double stop. No. Hey, it's not like I want you to remove it from the tongue. <laughs> I don't see how that improves anything. I want you to remove it directly from the animal's stomachs. Hmm. Lead A to B. Straight line. Quickly. Maybe A should leave B the fuck alone. Ooh. You really think this is gonna work? Any tips where to look? Any tips where to look? Inside the local wildlife. Deers are known for their appetite for grass. Just get me my sample. Oh my god, I have to kill those. Those jumpy deers. You really think this is gonna, gonna work? Son, please. please, I'm an inventor. Don't burn the house down. Be seeing you. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not sure if uh, kill three deers and collect the lambs. Okay, so that's the first time that I'm going to kill those deers that I see jumping around all the time. Um. The thing is that I'm not sure if. I'm not sure how to actually kill those deers and I'm telling you that because they are jumping jumping around all the time oh god so there is one I believe there it is don't move okay One I found. Second I found. Okay. One more. Come on, give me one more close here. Don't get me way too far away. What's this? There it is. Got it? Got it. All right, perfect. Got it. Get it back. Come on. Yes, don't give me another task. I'm going to for you. You did it. Now, watch the genius at work. Okay, be fast. Do your job. <laughs> Do your job. I removed talk to Grim. Genius at work. Do it. Right. <laughs> It didn't work. Yeah, it did, but not the way I wanted. 
What do we do now? What do we do now? We have to try something else. Oh my god. How are you gonna What? Oh my god. Okay, on my way. On my way. So uh, I've, I've. About time. You're very rude, man. You're very rude. So I know what I have to do, but I'm not gonna do it in this episode. Oh my God, this guy is very, very, very um, annoying and Cutter. What I do for you, my friend? Oh my friend, Cutter. You have to. You will thank me later because I'm going to ask for thanks. So. Anyways, I'm going to wrap up the episode here. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do. Cross the like button. If you didn't, you still know what to do, but I'm not going to tell you. Um, leave me a comment below. Tell me your opinion about the series, about the game, about everything. And hopefully I'm going to see you in the next episode. Um, I will get those items for, for this guy. Until then, take good care.